So my cousin and I were decently close, um, considering that she lived in Illinois and I lived in New Hampshire. But she had a lot of health issues and passed away a couple of years ago. I always think of her this time of year because her birthday was New Year's Eve. So I wrote this song called Memory for her. I usually start writing my songs by picking up whatever instrument I have on hand and just playing around until I find a riff or a set of chords that really sticks for me. In the case of Memory, there was this one little kind of haunting, repeating section that just felt like, you know, some sad, unfinished business, and I felt like it was really appropriate to build the song from this refrain. After I got the basic guitar skeleton structure down, the lyrics were pretty easy to write. I wanted a section of the lyrics that reflected the refrain in its kind of mournful repetition, and that's where the phrase don't worry comes in. It's a little too late to feel comforted, but you know that the person would have wanted you to be okay. Pretty much this song is for anybody who's ever lost somebody near and dear to them, or somebody they haven't seen in a while who meant more than they thought, and I hope it brings some amount of comfort to all of you who have experienced this. One of the things that I really like doing when I'm writing lyrics for a song is to imagine it as a conversation, whether it's you talking to yourself or you talking to somebody else or somebody else talking to you. I feel like it's a really relatable way to write. So with memory, I really wanted the deceased person, whomever they were, to have their own voice, which is why I included the refrain, don't worry. To me, that's them saying when they were alive, you know, don't worry, everything's going to be okay. And now that they're gone, it's them saying, don't worry, I'm fine. My main instruments are my Fender Strat and my Breedlove Acoustic, as well as my violin. And sometimes you can catch me putting in keyboard or piano here and there. I've also been playing around with software drummers, which has been fun. A little frustrating, but fun. And I hope to be using real drummers as soon as this pandemic is over. I don't like to write thinking of genre. In my personal opinion, if you come up with something that you're really in love with, that's catchy to you, that you want to use, it doesn't matter what style of music it is, uh, nor should you categorize it. It's just something that you like, which is why my music is kind of all over the place. I don't have one set style that I like to play in. If I like something, I'm going to write with it. Mm -hmm.